Missing phone, Army pays torture DJs N10,000 for the treatment The Nigerian Army authorities at Inkwa Road military base in Ahanku, Abba, Abia State, have returned the money forcefully collected from a disc jockey team by a soldier attached to the base, Mayo Aradini. The military also gave one of the victims, Afeni Ogba, N10,000 for the treatment of injuries he sustained in the hands of Adani and his colleagues. But a rights activist, Okechu Kuna Waguma, who petitioned the National Human Rights Commission on the incident, described the development as a ploy to shield the soldiers from appropriate sanctions. Saturday Punch had reported that Adani's phone, Gioni A1, got missing shortly after he arrived at his duty post at Grand Lottie World Hotels on EHI Road, ABBA, on May 26, 2018. The DJs, including Afeni's twin brother, Ogbonna, were at the hotel to perform for a colleague who was celebrating his birthday. Adabi accused the five DJs and two others, who he met on the hotel premises of stealing the phone and took them to Cameroon Barracks Police Station, where they were detained without being allowed to write statements. As the divisional police officer of the station released them the following day, the soldiers in two Hilux vans drove in and took them to their base. Afeni said the soldiers stripped and beat them with planks and later ordered them to contribute N93,000 to buy a new phone for Adani before they were released. While they all denied stealing the phone, Adani said he had a strong belief that it was stolen by one of them. Our correspondent learned that a senior officer at the military base invited Afeni in Ogbonna after Saturday Punch's publication and returned a sum of N66,000 the DJs contributed. Afeni told our correspondent on Friday that the officer also gave him N10,000 for the expenses he incurred while treating the injuries he sustained during the torture. He said, My twin brother and I were invited to the military base on Monday. The army paid us N66,000 which the five of us contributed. They also gave me N10,000 for medical treatment. They asked me to write an undertaking that we have been paid back. They also promised to reach out to the two other men and pay them. My three other colleagues are at school. I have informed them about the development. When they come back from school over the weekend, we will talk about the next line of action because we suffered a lot. We had been paid for some events that were to be held on the day, Sunday. The soldiers took us to their base. They did not release us until in the evening when we could not attend the events again. Meanwhile, the National Coordinator, Network on Police Reform in Nigeria, Nawaguma, said the refund was an attempt by the army to close the case without bringing the perpetrators to justice. The rights activist also called out the NHRC for not acting promptly on the petition, urging the commission to intervene in getting justice for the victims. He said, it is a bit worrying that nearly one month after NOPRIN addressed a petition to the National Human Rights Commission concerning the unprovoked brutal assault on Afeni and others, we have yet to receive any response. If not for the punches story, the military would probably not have responded. And in responding, they were not ready to go the full length to ensure that the perpetrators are brought to account. Read all also, court remands three for stealing cables, the military was only persuading the victims to accept the refund of the money extorted without addressing the need to punish those soldiers for abuse of power. We hope that the NHRC will ensure that the victims receive redress for the abuse of their fundamental human rights and the perpetrators made to account for their excesses to serve as a deterrent. The Director, Army Public Relations, Brig. General Texas Chukwu promised to contact the military base on the matter and get back to our correspondent with comments. He, however, had yet to respond as of press time. Think your friend would be INTRESTED? 
Share this story using any of the share button below down arrow place your text advert below greater than 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 loading Share your story with us via email. Info at 247 Nigeria News Update.co Receive news via our WhatsApp. Kindly text 234,701056-0394 to add you. Click here to join us on our YouTube channel for news update. Click here to join us on Twitter for instant news update at 247NGNEWSUPDATE. Click here to join millions around the globe to read news on our Facebook fan page for instant updates on Instagram. Click here receive instant news update via our BBM broadcast D3DEFDF.